Today on Animal Fact Files, we're discussing ragworms. There are currently almost 500 described ragworm species. They're also referred to as clamworms, and some species are known as mussel worms, pile worms, and sandworms. Like earthworms and leeches, ragworms are annelids. They're segmented worms. A ragworm can have just over a dozen to hundreds of body segments. The segments have parapodia, which are bristle-like structures used for getting around. Ragworms live worldwide in fresh, brackish, and salt water. Some live in freshwater caves situated well above sea level. Others have been observed in water-collecting plants. They're most common, however, from shallow marine coastlines. They also exist in the ocean's abyssal depths, and even semi-terrestrial habitats like sandy beaches. Many ragworms burrow into soft substrate like sand or mud and remain hidden in a self-dug burrow. Some ragworms remain in their burrow to catch food. They'll let out a net of mucus which catches any food particles floating by in the water column. The worm then eats the mucus net and anything caught inside. These worms are also scavengers, or predatory. Ragworms have jaws that are described as rivaling human teeth in hardness. These invertebrates are used as bait, and if mishandled, they can give a nasty bite. Ragworms hunt other invertebrates and in turn are eaten by seabirds, large crustaceans, and fish. Some humans also eat ragworms. In size, these animals range from an inch to over three feet feet in length. They're often red, brown, or even green in color and translucent. Their blood can be seen flowing inside their body. Ragworms begin life as an egg. They often hatch as larvae that settle to the seafloor until they develop into adults, but some are known to develop directly without a larval stage. Some species undergo a radical change in their body shape from juvenile to adult. Their two pairs of eyes increase in size, and their parapodia become oar-shaped, allowing them to better navigate while swimming. This may help these species avoid predators while spawning. Ragworm adults swarm to the ocean's surface at night. They're attracted to light. Here they'll release their sperm and eggs simultaneously into the water column, where they'll be fertilized. Some ragworms brood their eggs in their burrow, and others are able to self-fertilize. But all known species are believed to perish shortly after spawning. For more facts on ragworms, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, Spikesfield93, Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. And thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.